Ground Earth Canada, mounted on a giant praying mantis. Mounted bosses are probably some of the best looking sculpts made for this game, and this range has a lot of good looking sculpts. Period Japanese saddle and the banner was actually something the sculptor suggested mid-project, they were not part of the original idea. But it has to be one of the coolest things about this sculpt, and if you're wondering what that Japanese kanji character on the banner means, it means dangerous. When basing my miniatures, I often tilt them one way or another, that usually improves the pose. And by tilting this miniature back a bit, I think I made the pose a little less horizontal and possibly even a little more dynamic. So, I only got one more firm miniature left to paint now, and after I complete Lakask, I can start my next faction. I will be picking from Militia, Bondsmen or Wayfarers. Once again, I thought I'd show you what the sculpted scenic base looked like before it was painted. I think I'll start doing this for all my miniature showcase videos. So far, I've been sculpting with Millipot exclusively, but I think soon I'll need to start experimenting with other materials as well. Because this was a large 50mm base, I had enough space to make something a bit bigger than what I usually do. Really happy with how the tree on the other side of the base came out. How the roots are breaking through the rock and dirt and coming out on the opposite side. Because that's what plants do. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. Comments, suggestions and critique is welcome. And I'd be really grateful if you repost this video. It would help the channel reach new audiences. See you soon.